So some really guy, nice uh, scuba divers took it down for me. They said that show up in like 35 minutes, but I think the GoPro pretty much saved itself. But they took it all the way down into the spring head and uh, they got a good shot of it going straight down and then he got it back up once when it came about 10 feet up. So we took it like a good 40 feet almost, he said. So very appreciative, guys. <laughs> I'm going to try and do some free diving. I'm going to leave my snorkel here and uh, see what I can do myself. Let's do it. I'm going to try to dive straight down from here. See how far a dive I can get. That's going to be the only issue. Is my fins. That's deep. <laughs> Did you get the cave underwater? Uh, the scuba divers, when they were here, they took it out. Looks like we got a first rank now. Uh, Hit for focus. There we go, a little bit. Good time. Got a rank coming in. You kept moving the whole time. <laughs> That's incredible. Making friends. Amazing. Finding Thank fellow Floridians. Yeah. Definitely getting better. Yeah. Well, enjoy your swimming. Thank you. Definitely about to start raining in not too long. Whew. I'm glad that my Jeep, my GPS, oh my gosh. I'm glad that my GoPro didn't break when I took it down there. Well, not when I took it back down there, but when the scuba diver did. He took it all the way down to the bottom. He said at 35 feet shut off he couldn't get it back up until uh he got to 10 feet then it turned back on so i guess i gotta get a housing for it i want to take it down that deep again <laughs> at least it didn't break though but uh i'm i'm hoping that the shots turn out as good as what they look like they did on the screen so fingers crossed <laughs> i definitely don't think that my friend's gonna be coming out though Sorry about all the fogginess. It's just going from uh, the humidity out here to the cold water. 
shutting down the screen some. Yeah. Got some erosion over here. You can actually see that the spring is pushing out through that wall also. So that's why there's erosion. Love it out here though. I gotta get some of that stuff for my mask. Keep it from fogging up. It clears up once when I'm underwater. It just sucks while I'm actually wearing it above water. It's no bueno. <laughs> I'm so glad that the scuba divers did that for me though. That was awesome. Mosquito, go away. Down, mosquito. There's gotta be a way to use less energy when you're going down. Because I can float however long I feel like. But once when I'm actually like exerting myself to get down, that's when the trouble happens. Sun's coming out. Got some blue skies. Alright. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, there's so much activity down there that there's way too much sediment to really see anything anymore. Oh, my buckle keeps coming loose. The edges are all crystal clear as you can see. It's just once when you go to where the activity is, they stirred up all the sediment from the bottom and now it's just... Ooh, mosquito paradise, first of all. So now it's all just sediment in the water. You can't see as clear as you did when I first got here. And that's why I always like to get places early, is all these people are stirring up stuff and taking away all the clarity. On the top, it still looks beautiful, but once we're trying to dive down, it makes it a little bit more dangerous. So I didn't even see where the logs were that time. I know that the water level is rising, but I should still be able to see everything crystal clear. It's just because of all the people. So, but hey, people are enjoying their day. Manatee came over into the corner. I guess trying to check out the area for food. Oh, oh look at the fin! Let me see if I can go in the water and see it. <laughs> oh, I love that piece. not approach it yeah I came up over here but I'm not 
kind of stress it out or anything, keeping my distance, just to get some video of it to show you guys. But you always have to be respectful to these creatures. They're super peaceful, super curious. They'll come up to you every now and then, but they're protected. <laughs> yeah? <laughs> well, that was a nice little treat. Oh yeah, it's one of my favorite animals in the world. It's my heart that it's so hurt by the... Yeah. Did you see the latest article about the, uh, the armored catfish, the invasive one? No, I have not. Uh, they're actually to sticking to the manatee and, and stressing them out. Yeah. So. I noticed there was an, uh, big adult out Yeah. Yeah, that's definitely. I think I got a couple of pretty good angles of them. This just made my trip worth it. This is my favorite part of being in Florida, growing up here. Oh, he's diving down. Yeah. Yeah. I'm actually, uh, I'm wanting to get into uh, wildland fire. So doing controlled burns to preserve the land. But uh, I want to start volunteering to come out, clean out the rivers of uh, trash and everything. Oh, there he goes. Hey, buddy. <laughs> but uh, I really want to start getting into some of the preservation and whatnot. And uh, today I just saw they have the SaveTheManatee.org. So I'm going to look into that as well. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he was going down with the divers and everything also. He's checking everybody out. the manatee do his thing <laughs> yeah the lady that I was talking to in the kayak 
She was the Manatee Observer. So I kind of want to look into that now. I told her I was checking out SaveTheManatee.org, and she said that's how. Oh, I found a log. That hurt. That hurt. Oh, oh I ran into a log with my ankle. Oh. <laughs> but anyways, she said on uh, SaveTheManatee.org is how she got into volunteering as a Manatee Observer. So I kind of want to. Oh, that really hurts. So I kind of want to look into that and see what all I can do for that because Manatee is like my favorite species ever. So, uh, yeah, that's a hashtag life goals moment. <laughs> the Manatee's coming. <laughs> I thought I was all the way. He's coming right underneath you. <laughs> yeah, I love the manatee, man. Yeah, I love the manatee. <laughs> he came right up to me. <laughs> and I don't want to move. I'm startled him, so I just stayed still. He like rubbed up against me. Because <laughs> before he was supposed to be going to our right, then he was going to my left, and then he changed again and went straight for me. <laughs> Friends finally showed up. <laughs> All right, we gotta go that way. You up there? Yeah, I'm up this way. Oh, this way. <laughs> Got like 30 gar there. <laughs> the manatee is still there. All right. The manatee eats, uh, yeah, plants and everything. All right, guys. I'm gonna put my GoPro up, lock up a bunch of stuff, and show my friends the spring. So, until next time, guys. Peace.